This is my old satellite uh, dish TV that a lot of uh, RVs come with. Um, I no longer use it. You know, everyone streams everything these days. Uh, so I wanted to repurpose it to house my uh, Starlink standard uh, dish uh, and then repurpose the mechanism that would orient the uh, dish TV um, to, to, to align it uh, and be able to use that to align my uh, Starlink dish uh, while driving uh, automatically. Turn it on and it works. So uh, it's basically using a, uh, a Raspberry Pi with a stepper motor hat uh, on there. Uh, to control the original uh, stepper motor uh, and table that the original uh, dish satellite TV uh, used. Um, so again, it really, it basically was only able to turn 720 degrees, uh, so that way it wouldn't rip the, uh, you know, keep turning in circles until it broke the cables. Um, so it needs to know where it's at. So I'll show you what happens when you power it on. It's going to uh, initialize, try and find zero. It uses the original st um, uh, limit switch uh, that came with the, the Dish TV to find the zero. So that's zero. It's going to test it again just to make sure. Okay, it's zero. So now it's going to switch, rotate uh, back uh, 360 degrees so that it's centered so it can turn uh, 360 degrees in either direction to keep alignment. Once it's centered, it will then uh, turn automatically turn back to uh, the last known um, target direction of the, the Starlink satellite uh, facing the direction that it wanted to be in. It uses a, um, a compass to do, do that, and then it'll actually talk to the uh, Starlink satellite dish and get the updated uh, coordinates that it wants. So you can kind of see that it's actually in alignment. It did that fully automatic. Um, uh, there's also a couple other modes that it has. Uh, again, you can use the Starlink, uh, talk to the Starlink satellite to find the direction that it needs, or the amount of direction that it needs to be um, changed to. Uh, you can use a compass uh, in case it can't communicate, if it's not fully powered up yet or whatever, it can't communicate to the Starlink. Uh, dish, it'll just use a compass and, and the target direction, um, the last known good target direction that's set that the Starlink wanted to be pointed to. And then there's also a manual mode where you can manually adjust it using basically a keyboard that I've uh, uh, programmed uh, the, the Raspberry Pi do to respond to the different, different commands. So if I switch it into manual mode, I can manually adjust it and pushing right here, it's going to go counterclockwise. Uh, Push left, it'll go clockwise. And if we get it way out of out of alignment, so you can see I'm adjusting it, and you can see that the uh, focus here. Is, yeah, you can see that it's uh, turning out of alignment. And if I just push the auto button there, the auto mode is going to uh, automatically start communicating and readjust, and it'll go back to uh, what Starlink satellite dish is telling it to be would be in alignment and then you can see there that it actually is automatically in alignment and as you drive it'll automatically update um, and if it gets too far out of, of alignment say 15 degrees uh, it'll automatically uh, readjust um, yeah, so that's the project I've been working on